Archie Bedour's family hopes the Jump for Archie event will save lives. The Oconomowoc High School grad was just 19 when a heroin overdose killed Archie. His mother, Lori, works to raise awareness. I hope that this will make people think about education, whether it's getting trained at Narcan, whether it is um, taking a class. One key thing they're doing here to help is teaching family members and friends how to use Narcan to help a loved one overcome an overdose. This is the part that actually goes into the person's mouth. From Narcan training to more families telling their stories of tragedy, it's all part of fighting back against deadly drug abuse. Andy Dennison sings the song written by his brother, who died from a heroin overdose right after Christmas in 2013. Elliot was an aspiring singer-songwriter from Waukesha, who first was prescribed opioids for pain. It's not like they wake up in the morning and they go, hey, today's the day I'm going to put heroin into my body. It's a series of very small decisions that is made over a long period of time. He was an amazing stage presence. He was, he was a very talented young guy. Scott Dennison is Elliot's dad. The scary thing is, is that we need to start starting with kids that are in third, fourth grade, second grade to build up an awareness factor that they don't even want to try anything like this. At the Jump for Archie event in Oconomowoc, Terry Sater, WISN 12 News.